Obviously, when uh, entrepreneurs come to Strategic Coach, they want to grow faster than they're growing right now. And uh, so um, one of the things that I, I try to get them is to just ask them a question. Everything we do, you know, is in a framework of the future. So um, one of the most recent exercises I've created at the 10 times level is where I get them to identify all the way that they're making money right now. And then I ask them four questions about how they're making money right now. And the first question is, this activity, uh, if you stay with it, can it go 10 times? And you grade it on a scale of one to five. Is this activity actually, can it grow uh, 10 times? So if you just kept working with it, then at a certain point in the future, it'd be 10 times. The next one is, is this an activity that's actually uh, fascinates and motivates you such that the more you do this activity, the more excited, the more motivated uh, you become with the activity? Or do you need to stop doing this activity and have someone else do the activity who's more excited about it? Or just stop doing the activity altogether because if it's not exciting to you now, it's probably not going to be exciting to you uh, in the future. The th third one is, uh, and this is our different time frames in Strategic Coach, where I say, is this an activity that would last 25 years? In other words, if you were to think 25 years in the future, would this be a bigger and more important type of activity? Uh, whether it's a product or a service or you're creating some sort of solution, would that be more important 25 years from now? And then the, um, the fourth question you'd want to ask yourself, um, is this uh, an activity that would actually present the possibility of constant new innovation? Or is it just a cookie cutter type of activity that isn't going to be any different 25 years from now? And you, you'll get a score for each one of these and if you have um, you know, more than one income stream, and a lot of entrepreneurs might have three or four income streams, when you do this analysis, what you're going to notice is that there's one activity that just lights up like a neon sign that this is where you really should put your emphasis. Uh, in other words, it'll go 10 times. You're fascinated about the activity. Uh, it would last for 25 years. And the fourth thing is that it will constantly uh, allow you to create new innovations in it. And that's how you're going to grow as fast as possible is by switching your resources and your time to the activities that get the highest score. So if this interests you and it uh, triggers further questions that you have, then just write it down in the comment section and we'll be back to you.